This is your first sober interview? Yep. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? That's a good thing. And no, I'm not glow gang. I'm not glow gang. You know. Can you speak on that? Yeah. I just glow gang. That's how I, that's how I met glow gang. Cheeky. I went. I came to Atlanta. I went out to eat with his cameraman, cashier, cashmere, whatever, colorful mula, and he showed him my music. So he DM. So I just flew out there because he cheeky. Keith. You feel me? Thought I made it. So, I went from there, went from there. Then he got introduced to my niggas, the niggas I used to hang with and shit. He wanted to make it Category Boys. He wanted it to be a different group called Category Boys. But it was niggas that I, I didn't really fuck with that was in Detroit, so I was like, I ain't about to, I fuck with y'all, but I ain't in no group. I ain't joining no group. Cause I already know, you feel me, niggas switch up. Which niggas did switch up. See, one of the niggas who was in that shit in another group. So I knew. I know. I've been new. So I ain't really fuck with the shit. I'm on my own shit. My own level type shit. Still cool with Chief Keef? No, I don't really talk to that nigga. Okay. No beef, just. No, 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 no. I just don't talk to that nigga. I see. He probably closed a couple of those. He don't really fuck with nobody, you feel me? You don't fuck with everybody, so shit. I'm doing my own thing. 44 boys? 44 boys. 44 boys. Okay. Yeah. You feel me? Because we popping. I've been popping in the D in my city. I've been popping in. He put me. He gave me to Chicago. I've been fucking with G Herbo. I've been fucking with Wiz. My nigga Sledger, his producer. Uh. What's up with my nigga Bodie James? You know he was Nas. Uh, I'm gonna just fuck with somebody. Know who else? You're sober now. Yeah. <laughs> That's about it. Should be coming a little quicker to you. All right, what the fuck? That's about it.